<laughs> Happy Halloween, Coachella Valley. I'm the Windy Weatherman. There we go. Just for the effect, get rid of the prop. Happy Saturday to you. Happy Halloween. Good news for everybody. We're going to cool down this week. Can you believe it? Fall's actually going to be right on top of us. Checking our general air conditioning and heating live cam right now. It's a beautiful, clear night. Not a cloud in the sky. Big difference from yesterday now, isn't it? Lots of wind and lots of clouds we had all weekend. But today we get a break. Um, this is my little buddy. He flew in here. Uh, so I thought I'd introduce you to him and let him have a little moment on TV. There we go. Get rid of him. All right, back to work. Current temps right now, we're looking at 73. So a lot of the valley floor is seeing temperatures in the low 70s. So again, it's starting to actually feel like fall. Normally, this weekend, Halloween weekend, it's kind of cold. So we get one more little week uh, of some warmer temperatures uh, before we break off. Now, we're cooling off Monday. We're going to be seeing temperatures in the 70s, actually, come midweek. We will pick back up into the 80s this weekend. I'll let that, uh, leave that up to Ginger to tell you about on Monday throughout the week, because it's very possible that could change. Temperatures uh, today, right now, 69 for Palm Desert. Not bad at all. It's been a very mild, mild day, considering the time of year. Here's what to expect for tonight. 65 degrees, got a taste of wind coming from the southeast. Now, Ginger was nice enough to make this cool little graphic for us, so we have a lot of fun here on Halloween, at least I do. Checking our satellite right now. We have a pressure system that's going to be hugging the northwest and dropping right down on top of us. Uh, so come Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, lots of cloud cover, lots of wind, and a 20 to 30% chance of rain. And as you know, it seems like every week now we're getting a little chance of rain. And it's been happening, so keep those fingers crossed. Here's what to expect for tomorrow. Lots of nines. It's still going to be warm tomorrow. That break does not come until Monday, but I promise you it will be coming. Palm Springs checking at 94 degrees. Hello, Desert Hot Springs. You'll be seeing a high of 90 tomorrow. Check this out. I like to always emphasize ideal conditions for tram. 80 degrees, clear, clear skies. It's going to be gorgeous out there tomorrow. So if you have some time, check it out. And hello to our Marines. 89 is to what's to be expected for you for your high tomorrow. Now check that out. Your seven days going to be great. Lows in the 50s. We're anticipating lows around 51 come Thursday. And again, I cannot emphasize enough. There is a strong chance we'll get some wet weather midweek. So do your rain dances and keep those fingers crossed. And don't forget to turn back time. Sure wanted me to share that with you. Oh, you can, I can do it there again. There she is again. There she is. And Angela and I are both letting you know, turn back time on Sunday. Sure called. She wanted us to share that with you. You know, I'm really excited to get that extra hour of sleep. I've got yeah. to tell you. Yeah. You're ready to nice. go already. I, I know, exactly. <laughs> you know what else is? There's actually a Friday the 13th coming up in November. Mm -hmm. So, scary Halloween. Are okay. you, you going to dress up for us? Friday the 13th? I actually don't work on Friday, so there's a good oh, chance I will true. dress up and okay. I'll probably stay home in my Friday the 13th costume. <laughs> well, it'll be good weather. We know that already since it's cooling down. Once again, award for costume goes to Brian. Thank you, Angela. And thanks, <laughs> thanks viewers. Brian. And before you go to bed tonight, as we were just saying, don't forget to set your clocks back one hour because it